So at the start, um, you know, we wanted to make a, a stage, a hardware stage for software. Um, and what that, what that wanted to be and what that, you know, ended up becoming, like we didn't really know at the time. In, in some senses, um, you, you have an idea, like an idea is created um, and, then, and then you find out what the real problems are, right? And whether, whether the problem is a design problem or an engineering problem, a material science problem, um, an aesthetic problem, like the, the problems, you know, appear as you go through the development process. Like it is way easier to try something uh, than to tell somebody it can't be done, right? And so like when you see ideas that even if you're not sure that they're gonna work, like if you just try it, um, like A, you move the conversation to a better place, and B, like you don't have to look foolish in, <laughs> in, uh, in retrospect. Uh, and so I like, I super really try to try, right? And so, um, and there's, I think there's, there's magic in the like suspension of disbelief, right? That like, if you just do stuff that you know you're gonna be able to do, like you, like you know where you're gonna go, right? And so, um, but if you try something that you're not quite sure is gonna work, um, like at least new problems, you, like you're exposed to new problems and you get smarter that way. Um, and it, it, like in the good cases, like you actually like, you know, move the whole thing forward to where, you know, maybe it shouldn't have been. Um, and that's pretty good. You know, we joke in the, in the team that, uh, you know, we paid some people to study engineering and some people to study taste. Right, and so like there's this interplay between like kind of the engineering function of like mechanically, like how would you like enable these things to go do? And there's a bunch of embodiments that you could imagine. Like if all you want to do is put the screen like in a few different angles, like there's a, there's a ton of different ways to go do that. Um, but if you want to go do that and have something that's, that's super elegant and super normal, like it, it requires taste, right? To, to do something the right way. And then like the inspirations for those things come from, you know, desk lamps or come from, uh, like drafting tables and like the character of those ideas um, is as important as the content. And so like when those things come together, like the, um, the engineering and the taste um, is how, like how the ideas matriculate. Like the first time you see a prototype come back that is like, yep, that's, that's what we need it to be. Um, and you can uh, like the, the remaining problems kind of disappear and like, um, like the product reveals itself. And like those little moments, um, they happen in uh, lots of different aspects of the product um, uh, making. Like the first time you have a, a hinge prototype that um, that you can finally imagine what it's going to end up being. Um, like those are all like super fun, super fun moments. <laughs>